Game of Thrones Season 6 starts tonight, you guys. Mix me and some dragons. You ready to unbox them? Yeah! Let's do it! Alright guys, in honor of the Game of Thrones Season 6 premiere on tonight, Mix is going to unbox some dragons. What are you more excited about, Mix? The dragon pops or the premiere episode? Well, I'm opening the dragons right now, so I'm excited for them the most right now. <laughs> but after these are done, then I'm going to be the most excited for the premiere. <laughs> Alright, so we actually just ran out and got these, right? These we haven't unboxed yet, but we picked these up a few weeks ago, a couple like, weeks ago. Maybe even over a month ago. If you follow us on Instagram, and if you don't, why not? Uh, we posted that when we got them because it was really cool. They were on sale, and that's why we picked them up. Let's see how much did we save. The old mixed? price is on the bottom there. Oh, okay. There. How much is that? It's 50 bucks. Yeah, so 50 Canadian. bucks Canadian, but we got them for $30, $30 Canadian. Yeah. And a lot of you guys, I'll just throw this out there, when we put it on Instagram, a lot of you were like, oh, it sucks, they ruined it with the sticker. But the cool thing is, at EB Games anyways, which is our GameStop, these stickers come off really, really easy. So I thought I'd leave it There's on and just show you, like, check it out. Like, I'm just not even caring. They but, just come right off. Well, you gotta still kind of do it slow. If you rip it off like a band-aid, then you might get a little bit of cardboard with it. But see? Just, I don't know, awesome. I take them off and I'm not very good at taking stickers off. I kind of just rip them off and they always come off just for me even. They're pretty yeah. easy to take off. However, the, sh the other store that we shop at, it's called Toy Traders. Love them and love the store. But they, the stickers they use, it, they're really hard to get off. Plus, they leave so much residue, and yeah. uh, that's where we got one There's, of these. I can see these. some res residue on that one, I think. Yeah, so yeah, I'm now and then you get lucky. One. Anyways, enough about stickers. We have <laughs> too many things to unbox right now. So, uh, although this is pretty much the same dragon. It looks like it in the box anyway, so that it's, might be fast. Yeah. Looks right? like the same one with a different paint job. Yeah, we'll get it open and let's see if it is. That's what it looks like through the box. Gotta open Viserion first because I like the gold color of him better. I didn't really have a preference in the show because, well, they're both they're both kind of the same and Drogon just seems a little bit different because mm -hmm. he's so feisty. I like how we're stepping up our six inch pop game in one video. <laughs> we don't have a lot of six inch pops for some reason. I think we have Smog and I don't know if we have any other ones. Yeah, Godzilla. Oh he's, yeah. He's somewhere in here. I don't even know where he is. Uh, Viserion looks amazing. Oh, his wings were very bendy feeling. Like, look at those things. He, not poseable, though. No, not poseable. He <laughs> yes. looks crazy. That'd be cool if they came out, right? Oh, if they yeah. Out. If they spread, like, really big, that'd be awesome. He's covered in dragon scales, like, just tons of them, and then spikes all over his head. He's awesomely detailed with all the spikes around his eyes. Like, he's got all the ridges. He's got the dragon kind of nose. Tons of teeth in there. A little sharp-looking tongue huge spikes in the back and then his wings have like dragon scales just kind of where they would like meet his shoulder blades i guess do dragons have shoulder blades not sure mix <laughs> but then, you're the dragon expert <laughs> then it's all like bone looking down the spines of his wings i see that he has like you can tell kind of where he's all pieced together he's so big he's like mm -hmm. jointed together at his jaw his wings, like his arm wing the area. There, right? Yeah, the legs, the tail is even comes off. And the tail well, it doesn't come off. No, no, <laughs> that's where it would pop on when they are making this Removable guy. tail. Oh no! But he like has kind of like such a worm looking tail in the bottom there. Yeah, I love how it curves at the end. Yeah. That's cool. And then it's got like those big kind of fins at the bottom as well, right at the tip. So he's so cool looking. Oh, and he's just got the jet black, like I'm gonna eat everybody kind of looking on. Yeah. I'm eating you for dinner. He's awesome. Alright, let's get uh Regal. Regal, okay. I have a feeling that he's going to look the same, but even in looking the same, they're going to look awesome together. Let's get him out of here. I'll help you out. Is that all right? Yeah, I had a little bit of trouble. These big, <laughs> like the six inch pot boxes, I find that they're a lot harder to get out of there. They don't pull out as well because they're such stiff cardboard. Yeah, by the same token though, the boxes are a lot more sturdy than the small, than the regular yeah. size pops, right? Yeah. So protect your pop a bit better as well. That and if you care about nice boxes, these don't tend to get as damaged because they're a little bit more durable, whereas the other ones get a lot of scratches and everything in them. Sorry, Mix, what'd you say? I couldn't hear you. <laughs> this guy 
looks exactly the same. The green paint kind of makes him, it does kind of throw me off because I'm like, is there something different about him? But no, it's just the green paint. So he's got all the same kind of like scales and everything. His wings are bendy again. And he, he looks so cool. He almost looks cooler in green than the gold on Viserion, even though that's why I like Viserion better, because he's gold. I kind of like the pop being green. I think he looks more dragony. He's classic. He's, cla he's classic <laughs> dragon looking, but yeah, they're exactly the same. They both look amazing though. Yeah, that looks pretty cool. All right, Mix, which one is next? Uh, the Get metallic these three guys. Out of the way? Yeah, I want right. to see those little guys. I love all metallic pops. All right, so these guys are metallic exclusive at GameStop and EB Games. Yeah, I, I, it took me so long getting these dragons because I saw these guys in their not metallic forms in their little separate boxes, but I wanted these for so long we just never ended up getting them, and yeah, finally, oh. Finally we got them. I think you could buy these, or you could buy them before when they first came out on HBO. So. Oh really? I think so. These, tell us, tell us if that's true. I love their little faces because they look like they're smiling a little bit. <laughs> so let's look at Drogon first because okay. he is my favorite. He's my favorite because he's black and red and because he is like the cheekiest of all of them. And is he? Because those two are pretty cheeky. Oh yeah, they are pretty cheeky. But he flew away, like, he's the most rebellious, yeah, okay. I think. Although, yeah, they're pretty cheeky chained up. He just, the metallic look of these guys looks awesome. And then he's got his red spikes. He has so much less detail than these guys because they have, like, ridge scales, but he's just got kind of painted on scales at the back. They're not ridged or anything. What? Yeah, what's up with that? That's just his scales, just a little oh, patch they just, of... Oh, they didn't put scales no. all, all, all <laughs> no. over him. He should have scales all over. There's a patch on his head and tiny patches right, like, hmm. kind of on his tailbone there. He's got a little bit on his chest, knees, belly. He's got like a thinner kind of tail that comes out with just a few spikes on it. And then I love on the wings, it's like halfway painted, just red on the bottom there. And he's got like the red rims around his eye. Yeah, that looks good. So this guy's so cute. And his little like row of teeth, they look, it looks like a little dragon smile. And you can <laughs> see all the like different fangs sculpted in there. They're just tiny, so mm. it's so cute. I love him. Who's next? Uh, Vicerian. What? I'm going from my favorite to my least favorite. Oh, okay, I didn't know that mix. I know that they all have like the exact same sculpt and like paint detail on them, but mm. he looks really cool because unlike them, he doesn't really have a separate color, but I did just notice that a little bit on the back of his wings, there's a tiny bit of a darker gold, oh, yeah. just very faintly. Almost and like they airbrushed just a quick yeah, of just a, a tiny color. bit. It's like just a little bit of a different color. On the front, it's like that too. They look like they're the baby dragon versions they of do. these ones. They do, yeah. So, like when they first were hatched. But I love him. He's so cool looking shiny and gold like that. So, I don't know. I might like him in this form better than Drogon. So, Rhaegal has the exact same sculpt and all the details are the same. He's just green and metallic. And then his wings have. That's kind of like an a goldish, goldish green kind of mm. color on the bottom of his wings. He's Irish. He's, he does look very Irish. Gold and green <laughs> and very metallic. Oh, do they all have, oh I didn't notice, they have the little scales on the, their face as well, down like oh, their nose right. and on their forehead. I didn't notice right on him because he's so dark. So they all look the same, he's just green. I like him almost as much as the other ones. <laughs> <laughs> what is it, well, why though? I don't know, I like my series. Do you mean in the gold. show or just the style of the paint job? So. Mm. I like Drogon the best in the show. I like Viserion just because he looks cool because of the gold color. And okay. then Rhaegal's just my last favorite. <laughs> <laughs> All right, on to Danny and Drogon then. This one I had to open last because I knew that this one was going to be my favorite. The Danny in this looks really cool. We don't have a lot of Game of Thrones pops. No. no just a couple. And it's not because I don't love Game of Thrones, it's because there's so many yeah. that it's just it's like... overwhelming. It's a little overwhelming to try to figure out which ones to get and in what order. <laughs> oh, oh my goodness. <gasps> she, okay, I don't even know where to start. Together, they look amazing. Separately, I have to look at Danny. She doesn't have a peg or anything where she sits because she's so perfectly shaped that mm -hmm. she just sits on him like that. Yeah. She's holding on, her arms are like out so she can balance herself a little bit. Her legs are out so she can straddle him properly. Her dress is trailing behind her because it looks like she's maybe like flying right now. Her hair is so perfect. This is the <laughs> best pop hair I've ever seen. I'm gonna be sitting with this girl in front of the mirror and I'm gonna be like, how did she do that? It's like two braids coming back, looped around, a kind of 
of like bun that she's got going on in the back and then it's just all flowy and blonde and kind of wavy at the back and she's got the tendrils in the front it's more curly than I've seen on any other Danny Pop I think like she actually has almost ringlets going on with her hair so she looks awesome and then moving on to this guy I just love that he's different than the other two he's got the same kind of scales and spikes and everything like almost the same kind of sculpt but because he's in a totally different pose he's down and his wings are out and he kind of doesn't look like he's in flying mode he looks like he's about yeah. to take off or maybe yeah. he's just landed but what makes him way cooler than the other two is he's got those red eyes a little bit red just around his eye socket there and then he has an open mouth with big sharp teeth and that same kind of like dragony pointed tongue there <laughs> so I'm like oh my god I'm just fangirling yeah, over these cool. dragons I love them and I love how she just fits onto him perfectly there <laughs> that's pretty cool for a pop ride <laughs> that is amazing for a pop ride so as for Drogon is there a regular I know there's a Hot Topic exclusive of Drogon that's in a box like this yeah. shaped like this and he has red eyes is there a regular Drogon? I think maybe it's on the back of the box there. So is there a regular Drogon without red eyes? I should probably know that, but like I said before, there's just so many is Game it? of Thrones pops that yeah. I'm just so overwhelmed by that's them. That's Drogon there, right? Yeah, so maybe there, there well, probably must is be, a regular because one. he doesn't have red eyes in that picture. Let us yeah. know in the comments, guys, if that's the deal. And uh, But I don't think, well, it's up to you because, you know, these are yours your dragon collection, but uh, I don't think, do we need a, a Drogon when we have this Drogon? I think no. that's kind of cool. I prefer it with these two and then him as a ride because displayed, I think it's going to look cool mm -hmm. that there's three of the big guys, three of the little guys. I think it would look a little odd displayed having another Drogon in a different position, yeah. but I mean if you're a fan you need yeah. all the dragons, yeah. of course. For displaying purposes, I think it's going to look best with just the six. Yeah, and we do have kind of a thing where if we have one character, unless the variant is so cool, then yeah. we don't. We try not to get another yeah. of the same character. Yeah, I mean but, he's so so different than the other one. He's yeah. a ride, he's got yeah, Danny so on him. Yeah. But still, I would rather display them just with these guys, so I don't think I'll get the other one. I say that though, but then if you look at her Supernatural <laughs> collection, how many Deans and Sams do you have? Like 30? I think I have three of each. <laughs> I think I'm missing. And Am they, I missing some? I don't think so. She might argue, but they look the same. They look exactly the same. <laughs> <laughs> One has some blood on it. They do not. They're metallic and in FBI suits and then regular. All the FBI They're suits. They're totally yeah. different. But their heads are exactly the same. <laughs> so I love so them. wardrobe change, yes. <laughs> okay, might end up with the other drill gun. Alright, Mix, I think I covered this during the unboxing, but who is your favorite out of everything we unboxed? You have to choose from like each figure. Like each set of figures? No, no. <gasps> Separately, like I could pick just her? Mix, I'll show you. Who's your favorite? <laughs> this, 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 <laughs> or this? Okay, easily this one because then I get two figures in there. Okay. I love the metallic look of those guys, but this one, easily. Okay, if I had to choose, I think I'd go with the Funko Pop ride, I pretty guess. Pretty easy choice. Yeah, that's pretty cool. <laughs> I do like the metallic application on these ones. Yeah. So, uh, I like the whole thing. I think they're gonna look really cool to I like so. this as a set. That's just yeah. my choice. Yeah. Well, that would be my choice as well. <laughs> Let us know what your favorite was out of this dragon haul to celebrate Game of Thrones tonight. At least that's what Mix's excuse was to run out and get a bunch of dragons. And also, while you're down there telling us that, who's your favorite character on Game of Thrones? Or who's your least favorite character? That's still alive. <laughs> And while you're down there telling us that, if you see an icon that looks something like this, click it and give us a thumbs up, right Mix? Yeah! And what else? And subscribe! Subscribe to our channel because we're going to unbox so many more Funko Pops. Maybe even more Dragons, Mix. And we also unbox subscription boxes, which sometimes have Game of Thrones items inside. We have Mystery Monday every single Monday. Sometimes we do Game of Thrones blind boxes, although, do we have them all now? We have all of one set. We're still missing some from the first set. Okay, so there'll be more of those probably sometime. And we have really cool giveaways and a bunch of other stuff. So hit that subscribe button, hang out with us. Thank you very much for watching. You guys, oh yes you, rock. Enjoy Game of Thrones tonight.